we don't get a lot of moisture out here in southwest Nebraska. We only get about 15 to 17 inches a year. So we have to conserve that moisture. By leaving that uh, residue on intact on top of the soil, it's like going out into a garden and people will put straw on top of their, or a mulch on top of their uh, tomato plants and things like that around. And this is what we're doing. We're basically mulching. We're leaving that old wheat stubble out there as a mulch for the following crop to follow it. Uh, and the soil erosion was a big factor uh, when the ground was totally tilled. And when we started leaving residue out there, when we'd get a hard rain or a four or five inch rain in a few hours, it held that moisture throughout the whole field rather than letting it run off and wash ditches down through the field or break out terraces and things like that. The more residue you can leave out there, the more potential you have of catching uh, one or two snows during the winter and a lot of times that's equal to three four inches of moisture throughout the next summer and that's probably where we're picking up that 20 25 bushel yield increase with that residue staying on top of the ground out there another advantage of residue management is it will lower the temperature in the hot summer months uh, by 10 to 15 degrees and keeping it cooler so that that plant has a better chance of producing a good crop for you. We're looking at a lot of the residue that we've left over the last three years in this field. Uh, we've got corn stalks from three years ago, wheat stubble last year, and, uh, and then planted corn in here this following season. And this is the kind of residue. You can see here there's corn cobs still laying on the ground and the old corn stalks and stuff. Uh, it just makes good, good mulch for uh, raising a good crop in our fields and stuff. And if you look in uh, in the soil, it it stays really moist and nice. You can see how it's it's wet here. You can almost make a, a mud ball out of this soil. And that's something if you would have tilled that ground you wouldn't have had, you wouldn't have this moisture like this to um, produce a good crop.